What's up everybody, this is Mega Android. Today I'm going to show you how to install Ice Cream Sandwich on the Droid X. Now there's a couple things that I want to go over with you before we try to install this ROM. And the first thing being is to make sure you can install this ROM. Make sure you're on the Gingerbread kernel on the Droid X. And this is showing you how to install it from um, a, a ROM like Liberty ROM or CyanogenMod. Um, if you're installing on a stock gingerbread ROM 2.3.3 you're going to want to download Droid 2 Bootstrap and it's like two dollars in the market and that will install Clockwork Mod on your phone and then you can just follow from there but if this this is from the um, Clockwork Mod recovery from CyanEngine Mod so this is the one we're going to be following now the first thing I want to note is that this has bugs this is not a full ROM but mostly everything works and I'll name off what works radio including 3G calls and SMS speakerphone multimedia messaging Bluetooth GPS data uses monitor 2D and 3D hardware acceleration Wi-Fi sensors audio DSP Google talk SD card all hardware buttons charging USB mass storage and guess what guys it's pretty fast so what does it work is the voice input of uh, voice dictation inside the keyboard and voice actions from Google and the camera which is going to be worked on now when you're flashing this you're going to need to flash the ROM and G app so head on to the link that I provide down there in the description and download the ROM and G apps and go ahead and put that on your SD card once you put that on your SD card reboot in the clockwork mod recovery and once you reboot in the clockwork mod recovery you might you might want to back up your uh, ROM and I'm going to show you guys how to do this right now you're just going to go down with the volume buttons you're going to go to back up and restore it and you're going to click it with the camera button and you're going to go to back up and then it's going to back up your ROM on your SD card and that's it once you're done with that press back okay now time to install the ROM go to wipe data factory reset third one down click it Go all the way down to yes, click it, and just wait. Okay, once that's complete, you're going to go to wipe cache partition. And you're going to click the camera button. It's the fourth one down. And you're going to go all the way down to yes and click wipe cache. Okay, once that's complete, you're going to go to advanced. And click wipe Dalvik cache. And go all the way to yes, click it. Once that's done, you're going to go to back. And you're going to go to install zip from SD card, which should be the fifth one down. Click on it, click choose zip from SD card, and choose the ROM you downloaded and put on your SD card, which will be the ice cream sandwich ROM. Click the camera button. Now, this will take a few minutes, so be patient. But once that's complete, you're going to want to install G apps. To install G apps, you just go again, fifth one down, install zip from SD card, go all the way down to G apps. And install this shouldn't take long at all okay once that's done you're gonna go back you're gonna go to advanced and click fix permissions once that's done reboot recovery now note reboot can either take up to 10 minutes on its first reboot and you need to note that do not reboot the phone do not pull the battery um, because that will potentially mess it up. Now if you're stuck in a boot loop, which happens when the boot animation comes over and over again, then you may take out the battery and reboot. But if everything works well, you should be able to just reboot. See the ice cream sandwich boot animation looks very cool and nice. Okay, now once you've passed the boot animation and just booted your phone, you're now going to see the welcome screen. You're going to click start. And this is just the Android setup. But, anyways, this is Mega Android. Um, please stay subscribed. I'll be having a video touring the new ice cream sandwich ROM. Um, so, please stay subscribed and stay tuned for that. Anyways, this is how to install ice cream sandwich on the Droid X. Please catch on the flip side.